In the wild, encounters between apex predators and stealthy hunters are not uncommon. Among the most thrilling and unpredictable confrontations in the animal kingdom is the fight between a leopard and a snake. This battle pits the raw power and agility of a leopard against the cunning and specialized adaptations of various snake species. In this video, we delve into the dynamics of this dramatic encounter, examining the strengths and weaknesses of each combatant and considering the potential outcomes of their clash. Leopards, Panther apartus, are renowned for their prowess as solitary hunters. As one of Africa's big cats, leopards possess a formidable combination of strength, speed, and agility. They are muscular felines, with powerful jaws and sharp claws designed for climbing and grappling with prey. Leopards are known for their stealthy approach and powerful ambush tactics, making them highly effective predators. A key advantage of leopards in a fight is their exceptional reflexes and combat skills. Equipped with retractable claws and a strong bite force, leopards are capable of inflicting severe damage on their adversaries. Their agility allows them to maneuver swiftly, whether they are climbing trees or pursuing prey. This versatility gives leopards a distinct edge in many confrontations, including those with formidable opponents like snakes. The term snake encompasses a wide range of species, each with unique adaptations and strategies for survival. For our discussion, we'll consider three primary types of snakes that might face off against a leopard. Venomous snakes, constrictors, and non-venomous but potentially dangerous species. Venomous snakes like cobras, vipers, and pit vipers are equipped with specialized fangs that deliver toxic venom. This venom can be neurotoxic, hematoxic, or cytotoxic, leading to paralysis, tissue damage, or even death. The venomous bite of a snake can be a game-changer in a fight, potentially incapacitating a leopard if the bite is delivered effectively. However, a leopard's thick fur and skin offer some protection against venom, and the bite may not always be lethal immediately. Large constrictors like boas and pythons rely on their immense strength to subdue and suffocate their prey. These snakes are capable of wrapping around a victim and applying pressure until the prey succumbs to asphyxiation. In a confrontation with a leopard, a large constrictor could pose a serious threat if it manages to coil around the leopard and apply its constricting force. However, leopard's agility and sharp claws could make it challenging for the snake to maintain a grip long enough to subdue the leopard. Some non-venomous snakes, while not as dangerous as their venomous counterparts, can still pose a threat through their size, strength, or defensive behavior. For instance, a large rat snake might be able to put up a fight using its size and strength, but it would generally be at a disadvantage compared to a leopard. The outcome of a fight between a leopard and a snake hinges on several factors, including the type and size of the snake, the environment, and the strategies employed by each participant. Let's explore some possible scenarios. If the leopard and venomous snake encounter each other, the leopard's primary strategy would likely involve a swift, decisive attack to avoid the snake's venomous bite. Leopards are known for their quick reflexes and powerful strikes, so a well-timed paw swipe or bite could incapacitate the snake before it has a chance to deliver a fatal bite. However, if the snake manages to strike first and inject venom, the outcome could be precarious for the leopard. The effectiveness of the snake's venom and the leopard's ability to receive medical treatment would be critical in this scenario. In a confrontation with a large constrictor, the leopard's agility and strength would play a crucial role. If the leopard is able to avoid being constricted initially, it might use its claws to tear at the snake's coils and break free. However, if the constrictor manages to get a firm grip, the fight could be more challenging for the leopard. The constrictor's success would depend on its ability to subdue the leopard quickly before it can retaliate. Against a non-venomous snake, the leopard's advantage would be significant. The leopard's superior strength and agility would likely allow it to overpower and kill the snake with relative ease. The snake's primary defense would be to avoid confrontation or use defensive displays, but against a determined predator like a leopard, these strategies might not be sufficient to turn the tide. The fight between a leopard and a snake is a fascinating example of nature's diversity and the intricate balance of predator and prey dynamics. Leopards, with their incredible strength, agility, and combat skills, are formidable opponents in the wild. Snakes, whether venomous, constricting, or non-venomous, bring their own unique adaptations to the table, making each confrontation a complex and unpredictable event. While leopards generally have the upper hand due to their size and predatory prowess, snakes have evolved specialized adaptations that can pose significant threats. The ultimate outcome of such a battle would depend on a multitude of factors, including the species involved, the environment, and the specific strategies employed by both adversaries. In the grand theater of the natural world, every encounter is a testament to the diverse survival strategies that animals have developed. Whether it's the stealthy strike of a snake or the powerful charge of a leopard, each interaction tells a story of adaptation, evolution, and the relentless pursuit of survival.